Well, I'm back at the shooting bench. I've got my gun on the MTM shooting bench again. And the reason is, is I managed to drop my gun while I was coyote hunting with my buddy Wright last week. I get teased sometimes because I trip every once in a while or I run into stuff. My friends call me clumsy, but I think it's because I'm concentrating so much on looking for animals way out in front of me that I don't sometimes see what's directly in front of me. So I'm gonna go ahead and check my gun on this water bottle. If it's on, I'm not gonna mess with it anymore. All right. That is a deadly combination. Loophole, Hornady, Rock River Arms, feeling pretty confident. So when I go out with right, I know that my gun's on, give me the confidence to take any long shots or close shots that we may, uh, we may encounter this week. All right, I'm feeling good about that. You know, I love hunting coyotes. One, it's important. We have to keep a manageable population of coyotes, but in some of the areas that we hunt, we have too many coyotes. We've had problems with calves, we've had them kill our chickens, so we have to keep them managed on the ranch. The other reason I enjoy it is because the absolute beautiful things you get to see outdoors. It's just another reason to be outside enjoying nature. Watching the sun rises, the sun sets, and all the different animals that you get to see, besides the coyotes that you're after, well, it just makes it worthwhile whether you call a coyote in or not. Well, it's a good thing that I enjoy those beautiful sunrises and views and other animals because our first set, we didn't call in a thing. So we decided to pick up and go try another spot. We're over two this morning so far. <laughs> but pressure's getting on. We'll drop off this ridge. We won't go too far. Set up the call. We'll be calling to this whole valley, so hopefully something will come in. Well, this setup was beautiful. We had a great view. We were set up in the rocks and we could see a long ways. Right was on the left, I was on the right. We had Cole running camera right in the middle. We had the wind in our direction. Everything was perfect. Usually I like to set the Fox Pro call down in front of me quite a ways, but on this setup, we had it just in front of us, not very far. The reason for that was I was hoping it would draw a bobcat or a coyote right up the ridge toward us. But we had been calling for about 15 minutes and hadn't seen a thing. And I got a glimpse of movement right out in front of us. I looked up and I said, there's a coyote. He's right in front of us. It took Cole a second to find him. And I showed him exactly where it was and he picked him up in the camera. Just open that I had already ranged a bunch of spots, so I knew how far he was. And when it comes to shooting a coyote over 200 yards, I don't care what anybody says, it's time to bear down a little bit. That's where you want a good scope, a good flat shooting rifle, and you want to know the range. Well, one shot, put that dog right in the dirt. <laughs> That's how you smoke a coyote right there. That was awesome. Out there a little over 200 yards, and uh, we called him right in. So now we were on the board. We were one for three, and I was pretty happy with that. That's about our average here in Colorado. Seems like wherever I call, whether it's public land, whether it's private land, for every three sets, I average a coyote coming in. So if you see how nice that coyote's furred up, well, that's beautiful. Only him down here to take a look at him. Real nice fur on him, thick. It's a young dog, it's last year's pup, hunting by himself out here. Signature Rock River counted for another one. <laughs> yes, sir. Yes, sir. That's what's nice shooting long ranges. I've got the 14 power loop hold on here. And, uh, you know, when you got a dead rest like I did, it really made that a relatively easy shot, you know. And once you start getting over 200 yards, I mean, you got a, a, lot, of, a lot of margin for error, <laughs> especially on a small coyote. But that worked out great.